Fragrance King. What's up, everybody? I'm back. So I'm going to be going over Dior Home Original 2021 batches. And then uh, Dior Home Intense. I got a backup bottle, too. My backup bottle says Intense right there. And my small bottle does not, just so you guys know, too. And then I'm gonna just throw this in later on for people that don't like Iris. This is the 2020 Dior Home. So let me just start off by going yesterday. I threw this on me, the original. And this is the one I would recommend. I would recommend this one. Classy man, I'd say button up with the tie or just a button up suit. Kind of a kind of a setting for this this is classy and it's just three notes iris cardamom and vetiver and the iris pounds cardamom pounds and this lasts a while a long time it's i would choose that over this because i think that this is this one's more manly i'd say this is more manly put together this one's a little more feminine, but it's still good too. Depends on what you like. So this one has more notes. Lavender, iris, amber, pear, cedar, and vetiver. So this has some woodiness to it. I've seen reviews where people compared it to smelling a woman's purse. It can't chocolate in it. So this has a chocolatey kind of a smell. So it's similar. You get the iris. It's softer in this one but it has a chocolatey vibe to it, chocolatey smell rather. And then it has that cedar pencil shaving smell too, and it lasts, I think this one lasts a little bit longer. Um, and the iris is a little softer. This is hyped up big time. The, the Dior Intense is hyped up. So I wanted to just do a comparison because I'm recommending the original. The original's just better um, for me anyways. It's, it's what I would choose. I have two bottles. I've blown through a lot of this in the previous years. And I don't haven't even tapped into the back one. I bought a backup one because I was like, I liked it back then. And I bought a sample of uh, Dior Home Intense. And it was an old batch. And the old batches smell different. They're, they're better. They're better. That's what led me to buy these bottles. And these bottles don't smell as creamy. The old batches are better, so if you can get your hands on an old batch of Dior Home Intense, it's better. It's better, in my opinion, but it's not It's not worth it. I'm going with the Dior Original. And if you don't like Iris, because the Dior Home 2021, I had it on yesterday, and I'm just going, just quit, just quit. It was hot, and it just pounded, and it projects. And so I, I wanted it to stop. So if you don't like Iris, this is a bergamot cedar vetiver fragrance. I would recommend the new one. It still has a classy, similar type of you know, setting, aura, feeling, vibe, certain kind of presence to it. Um, so longevity with the intense, it's off my skin, you know, eight plus, and it's on my clothes the next day. With the original home, it's strong. I think it projects some more. And it is still eight hours. I'm, I'm like, just quit, just quit. So it's just, it's a lot, it's, it's good. So the 2020, more fruit, bergamot in the opening. It projects good too. I would say it's similar in performance. And it's, it's a different classy Dior fragrance but you're still going to get the same projection same uh similar uh performance close the next day but a little bit more subtle um there's just something about this Dior home original that it's that's why i'm going to recommend this one this one i think is just more manly this one's more more feminine it's got the chocolate women's purse pencil shaving smell to it and so i'm not sure if if this is just so underrated that no one really knows about it and if the what the women actually prefer maybe i'll take this to the streets one day 
to just really give some clarity to it because a lot of the women are like yeah they love this but it's like if they really smelled this on their man i think that they would probably like this one better and yeah and do not hold this from the cap i just dropped it and so this is one that you can't pick up by the cap but uh all right, that's my take on Dior Home. Original Dior Home Intense and alternatives to Iris Dior Home 2020 because I'm not in the mood for Iris that much ever. But if you wanted to have a nice formal scent, I would go with uh, Dior Home Original 2021 new batches. Cheap off discounters. I think I got that for 70 bucks back a year ago. So I think it's some, somewhere in the realm of $70, $80. That's it. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Fragrance King.